So what if I were sitting here holding my phone like this without wires, without having it in a wireless charging pad, but my phone was charging? Xiaomi says they're there. Are they really there? Well, let's dive right in. Let's go. So the news broke today that Xiaomi has filed a number of patents that allow wireless charging. And this would be a game changer. What they say is that they're using very high frequency millimeter waves to transfer energy to charge your phone while not being connected to a pad, while not being connected to a wire, really over the air charging. And they've made a really good video to show that. So in this video, they're explaining how they are wirelessly charging phones. First of all, they're using 5 watts wireless charging. And they also say they can charge multiple devices at the same time. So that is really cool. So imagine uh, you're in a space with like three people and all your phones can be charging at the same time while you're either just looking at it or playing a game or just hanging around. They also mentioned they have it working in a range of a few meters. They don't exactly specify the range. I saw some people online saying it is five meters or something, but I think uh, as I read and heard it correctly in the video, they are saying it is a few meters of range. So what they did is they created this box, as you can clearly see in the video, which has 144 antennas sending out these beams, basically locating and pinging your phone, and that will actually remotely charge. Well, this box looks, first of all, it looks rather big. It's not like a small compact hub type of thing that you would already buy. So the best case scenario for me would be if we have like one of these smart speakers, we just place it in our room and this works as a, as a hub, maybe as a Bluetooth hub, but also as a wireless charger. I mean, that would be ideal so that we have something that is very multifunctional, doesn't really look like a huge box in your room because face it, nobody wants to have a huge box in their room just to charge five watts, you know? but they have filed the patents. It means they are working on it. It means they are developing this technology and that is a great step. But I do wanna point out two important things and that is Xiaomi has been teasing some technology in the past few years, like the in-screen camera, for example. Well, we've seen it recently with the Mi 11. There is no in-screen, like a true in-screen camera just yet, even though they have been teasing the fact that they have been working on it I think already one and a half years ago. So sometimes they like to tease some new technology that is not ready for production, but they already have and they just want to show off. Like spread those feathers and show what you can do, Xiaomi. So I think that is what they're doing. They're just showing like, hey, we've got the technology, we're working on it. It's not ready for mass production, but we're working on it. So I think that is what's happening here. And it's also not the first time we see something like this. On CES, over the last few years, there have been a few other companies that have done something similar. As a matter of fact, I've seen something um, that is actually production ready in one of Linus Tech Tips videos, where he's playing with a train. This can deliver about one watt. Then there's the larger one that we put on the ceiling that can do up to three watts. But these trains right here can be fully powered by the transmitter up in the ceiling, giving you some idea of how quickly your phone or your other device could be moving around the room and still be powered and or charging. The technology is getting there, but the fact that Xiaomi is working on it does mean that maybe in the next one or two years, we could see something actually come to fruition and being real. But the fact that they are working on it, they're saying that uh, they want to implement this in wireless charging for headphones or for speakers and probably anything that you bring along, something that is portable like a phone or headphones or speakers that you bring along to charge that while you're just having it in a room. So the fact that they are working on it is really a great step forward, but I don't think it is production ready just yet. But the fact that maybe in a year 
or two years, I can be sitting here and saying, hey guys, it's Wick for Xiaomi Fi. Look at me, I am literally remotely charging my phone while I'm holding it like this. Already, there's quite a few memes. Maybe you can fry chicken on your, on your phone. I doubt it. I'm sure that they're testing this very, <laughs> very carefully. And uh, if it's just five watts or maybe eventually 10 watts charging, I doubt we're gonna be able to fry chicken, fry our brains or fry our organs with it. But who knows? If there is any possibility of me going to Beijing, which is very difficult right now with a lot of travel bans and a lot of restrictions, even domestically in China to travel. I would love to go there and see if I can really try it out in person. If I do, you know where to find me because I'm gonna try to be the first to do an actual impression video in Beijing if I get the chance to do so. So yeah, I just had to break this news. I am working on a couple of review videos that are coming up very soon. Some interesting stuff, some smart home products, some new phones, a lot of stuff happening right now. So. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, know that you probably should because I'm doing a lot of videos about Xiaomi and uh, products from the Xiaomi ecosystem right here on the Xiaomi Fi channel. So as always, thank you guys for watching and I hope to see y'all soon. Peace.